I am so excited because I have been joined by a plethora of Malkaroys here at the table. Oh, okay. How we were just talking about this. So you're the baby. Yes. You're the oldest, and you're just smack dab I'm in the middle. Middleist. That's you're the middleist. Yes. And hey, Dad. I'm the Pater Familia. Yes. We've sat in no kind of organized order of age. I would expect nothing less. Uh, so I'm really excited to have you. This is the second, third time I have. Uh, yes, yeah, so I've yeah, done a bunch of. We've, we've known each other our whole lives. It's fine. Yes, that's uh, true. But how are your? How's Comic Con going? How is second day of San Diego Comic Con going for y'all? It's great. Busy, running around. Yeah, yeah, to varying degrees of busyness. We, we spent a very stressful morning at an event that had actual famous people at it, real life famos, and it was very, very distracting. Yeah, yeah. we just sat in a corner trying not to get noticed. It was yeah. great. I ate eight scones. Just eight scones. scones. It was, wow. scones. It was, it was very wow. stressful. That scones are, that's a, that's a different level of pastry right there. You Is haven't it? eaten a scone until you've eaten one while looking at Fred Savage. <laughs> Yeah. That's what they say. Yeah, on, on that's great American old saying. That's what Ben Franklin wrote. <laughs> so they say yeah, on great that's British Bake Off. Tale as old as time. Mm. Right. Uh, so y'all literally across the board, and we were discussing that. Is there anything you don't do? Like, how do you? F let's, Dad. How do you feel? Like, podcasting, writing, comic books, tap dancing, some no sports ball, but it's, great hair. Um, it's amazing. I, I'm I'm glad I retired from my day job so that I could. <laughs> be this busy uh no I, it's terrific i mean i get to to travel with with these guys i mean i i have to stay in my own room on a different floor yeah, yeah. He, kno he knows what he did uh, yeah uh we, we keep him in a steamer trunk but <laughs> yeah but no it's 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 a great honor to be able to work with with your kids and and especially when you get along which we occasionally do so every uh, once in a while yeah yeah and it's just it's just a kick to see the reaction that, that we get to, from people and, and the fun that they're having while we do it. So there's a lot of amazing stuff going on. I could literally list the plethora of things that are here on my amazing one pager. But what are you most excited about for fans to get to see out of the McElroys this year? Uh, we're up? really excited to do Journey into Mystery with yes. Marvel. Uh, we got to write for Spider-Man, which was really cool, and Wonder Man, which is my personal dream job. And then we also just came out with the graphic novel, the Adventure Zone graphic no novel, uh, Murder on the Rockport Limited. Uh, pretty excited about that. Came out on Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah. Still riding that wave. Yeah. That new new publishing oh, wave. New book smell. Yeah. <laughs> Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> um, so when you're working as a team, particularly when you're working as a family, I'm sure there are some differing of opinions. Uh, Hopefully, maybe. Are you just a hive mind? Is that a little? We're we, kind of a hive mind. We, I think, I think we all have our strengths that the other ones sort of know. Like Dad has been writing comic books for, I mean, since we were little kids. Yeah. Um, so he's got a really good sense of pacing and layout and and scripts and stuff like that that works really well in comics. So when we are doing like comic stuff, I think we we tend to follow his lead. Um, and then he comes to us and says, make it funny, please. No, I don't know how to be funny. <laughs> I don't have any jokes in me. Yeah. You boys bring it, right, Dad? All my out? jokes, you know, are like from the 1930s. Yeah. Yes. So. It's it's like if a caveman could write a comic yeah. book. A lot of references to 23 Skidoo. <laughs> yeah. Right. That. Yeah. Uh, so what does the process look like? Are you got? Did you mostly work by emails? You do you stay in the same house and order a whole pizza and have a slumber oh my, party? Like that how does an, this work? That would be an unsurvivable arrangement. <laughs> uh, we we work a lot when we're in the. When we start with an outline. We start with a, a pretty extensive outline, uh, and then I kind of lay out basically panel by panel, and and then we just kind of start working on it. We have a script. We work with Google Docs. So we share the, the script so immediately as soon as somebody makes a change, the other one can see yeah. it, add notes to it, and it's a pretty constant process. We, we don't really have a first draft, second draft, third draft, yeah. anything like that. It just kind of always changes on a, almost on an hourly basis. Right. We work together on so much stuff, not, not just comics, but podcasts and everything, and none of us live in the same city, so we, you know, uh, online tools are like our lifeblood yeah, for we, everything we do. We make. all work pretty asynchronously because we got kids and stuff, so, you know, whenever you can grab 20 minutes away to look at stuff, uh, you do. So we don't get a lot of time to just like sit around a table and like go through something together. 
Is there anything that you think you guys are particularly, like for this year, for 2019, that you're particularly proud of, besides obviously riding the wave of a new book smell? Right. Um, Because I feel like you would have to challenge yourself every year. Obviously, you've got legacy. Um, You're clearly looking at all of the mediums. Um, Is there anything that you feel like, as a team, that you're like, oh, man, I didn't didn't think we were going to, but we made it happen, and it was great? Uh, we have we have a lot of stuff that we're that we're working on and that we've already done. But when we got asked to do this for Marvel, that was like that not to like uh, discredit any of the stuff that we worked on in the past. But that was such a wild. Uh, uh, we are all comics fans to varying degrees. Dad being the, by far the largest because it's been like his his thing for his whole life. But getting asked to do something with Marvel has been like legitimate, like great life opportunity. Number one bucket list stuff. Also, we conned our way into Trolls World Tour. We yes, made it into the next Trolls movie. We each get one line, or maybe more, or maybe less. We haven't seen the movie, and we don't know what parts we're playing. We read a lot of different parts, which you always do. If you bring yeah. in a heavy hitter, you don't tell them what part they're playing, and you have them read six different ones. And, and you, you maybe cut. have three actors read the same lines and yeah. say, we'll give them to one of you. Yeah. <laughs> one of you, yeah. So That's that a, we're really hanging our hat on that one. And I was really in the running for Sharknado 12, and then they stopped making this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. He was going to be the shark. He read for Sharknado. I yeah. hear. I hear that there may be I'm more. I'm so full of oh, sharks. Right. I hear. Okay. But we'll talk about that later. Okay, uh, okay so we're going to end this very quickly. What are your superpowers? Speed answer, go. Uh, I can fly. Great. We'll talk about that after the interview. Okay. I, I can find a bathroom anywhere. I can catch on fire, but only once. <laughs> <laughs> I can see into other people's minds. I can understand what it is. Oh, and I mean, literally oh, inside cool. their brain. The oh, great yeah, yeah, the, 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 the meat for you, the, the meat stuff. Yeah. Yeah. All you're just seeing is need for yeah. lunch right uh, now. Yeah, look, at my, <laughs> look at my mind. We're bombing. <laughs> ah, got, got it. it. You got it. Well, thank you so very much. It's always great to see all of you.